Okay. This, this next story I think you're really going to enjoy. I, I think we all will really enjoy this one. <laughs> Every year, as temperatures hit their lowest, people get creative testing just how cold it is. Jeannie Most takes a look. Why just trudge through the cold when you can use it to experiment? It used to be civilians. <gasps> posting their weather tricks online. But these days, actual weathermen are demonstrating what happens when you throw boiling water in temperatures below zero. Ready? <laughs> Oh, yeah. Hey! We're calling these stupid weather tricks the kind we can't resist. Water to vapor! Minus 40! Yeah. A beautiful day! But anyone who plans to try this when it's warmer than, say, 20 or 30 degrees below zero better bring an umbrella to avoid risking second degree burns. Floating around the internet, you'll see giant bubbles crystallizing in the cold. You'll see what a super soaker does, sub-zero. Go for it. <laughs> but the most popular stupid weather trick this season seems to be the frozen wet t-shirt. And take a look. It took less than 10 minutes for it to come completely freeze over here. It only took six minutes. Which we can now hold upside down because it is frozen solid. That took two, three minutes. And if frozen t-shirts leave you cold, how about a frozen banana? Instead of a hammer... Or a frozen egg in Minnesota where it was 20 below. Of course an egg freezes. It would be news if it didn't, but it looks funny. Or if it's egg on your face you prefer, show up on TV in a funny hat. That is a serious piece of business, and it looks I like, good, oh, too. I like it like that. That's best like that, yeah. Kevin. Now, I may look like a bank robber tonight, Scott. Just last week, Jimmy Kimmel was making fun of Southern California news anchors for freaking out when temperatures dipped into the 50s. Cold, 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 coming our way. We have team coverage on this freezing cold weather. The extra blanket, the heater, the dog, anything you can do to keep warm, snuggled. How long will this Arctic blast last? Long enough for us to beat the frozen T-shirt into the ground. It is solid. I'll confirm. It's frozen. Genie Moose. You look like Mickey Mouse. <laughs> CNN. Okay, okay, there you go. There we go. Look at that. Eh? Whoa. <laughs> New York. I like the water. Uh, the water gun. Well, tell Scott real quickly. Stepping. Oh yeah, up last week up in Sun Valley, I threw the the swim suit in the back of the pickup. Came yes. out the next morning. Not only was it frozen, I couldn't get it off the pickup. <laughs> It was it was in the back of my pickup for two days. <laughs> so it's true. Still a thawed in yes. the garage. Yes. <laughs> so when it's cold, it does freeze. We we did find that out. There, we right? did. Have you ever done any of those? Because I haven't. I've always wanted to do the hot coffee, but it's never been cold enough. You really do have to get down to 20, 30, 40 below is that magic number where oh. things they just That's don't. Okay. Oh, we, can we only don't hope. need to see it. We no, we don't need to see it. Thanks, Scott. <laughs> Coming up next on Fox 9 on your side, you want to kick.